another mission from the last one that we have seen all together and uh, yeah that should be pretty cool so yeah today you will be basically walking me through spider nest castle an amazing mission full of spiders for those of you that of course like it and uh, pretty much this will be it today we are building the ninjutsu skill it's tremendously cool and I will be basically telling you why why this is so cool because later on we're going to build something that is truly unbelievable hey golf the vodka how are you doing man coming in 10 minutes after a match I assume a rocket league one then I assume a rocket league so what are we going to do today actually first of all let's go to the shrine so in the shrine what are we actually going to see? We're going to see a little bit of Kodamas and let me know guys how are you doing anyway? I need a lot of elixir so I assume yes I assume pretty much that would be it. Release blessing not a chance. Let's replay the current one not a chance. Uh, drop rate of materials well, that couldn't be bothered. Amrita 5% would be actually cool but I need more elixir because it's the first time. Please kill somebody. Let's go straight away yes Okay, let me show you straight away how killing somebody works in here. Like this, man. Okay, then there is a big spider you will love to see killed. He's actually here. i actually dropping a stone right now. Hopefully we'll kill the spider. No chance. No big deal anyway, no big deal. Bullseye. Yes, one shot, one kill. Hike stance. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, damn it. Wow, oh, man, you, you should have actually. Damn it, man. I told him. Okay, he didn't get us. He didn't get us. So come here. What the hell, guys? I think I'm a little bit slow. I totally am slow. This is not the right chance I should be using. Yeah, let's go for the middle one. Let's go for the middle one. Again, 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 again. You can oh, totally get him. So basically what I did is that when you see that they are basically red, uh, basically they have the, the right thing on the top of their head. It means that they, they, they cannot basically attack you before you actually attack them. So this is why at that point you should, you should do everything in your power in order to destroy them like in this case let me just get the head of this bastard yeah we got it so here there should be another of those guys we actually are looking for a talisman i do believe now let me show you something else pretty cool okay wow 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 he actually broke our our stance so let me show you how to counter attack okay this didn't work as i expected it should totally work anyway, so... Oh my gosh, don't tell me that it only works with spear users. Ah. Oh my gosh, guys, <laughs> I can't get to work basically the... the counter-attack. Okay, I don't think it works. Nah, it doesn't work guys. If you are not using the same weapon as your enemy, it doesn't work. Okay. Good to know, I guess. Good to know. So, against peer user, I have the counter attack. This should be sufficient to get us going. Oh, 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 oh. okay, he's coming. Let me show you this, guys. Let me show you this thing. Wait, 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 what? Okay. This is not what I wanted to show you. Let me show you this. It's a new technique. Ah ha ha! Wait, this was supposed to extremely slow him down. And as you can see, it pretty much slowed him a lot down. Yeah, this, this should also have ended up in his death. But as you can see, now we got it working. Anyway, how are you doing guys today? Uh, actually, I'm still looking for, I think, a collectible I'm missing over here and I can't get to get it. 
I'm waiting for one. I don't know. You need to get some talismans or this type of things that are in the game. And I think that once you actually will get all of them, you should be able to open that door. Thing that didn't happen yet. So let me get down here first of all. And the uh, Yusuf will be here in 18 minutes. We will be waiting for you then. So here I bet there is something. Yeah, there was something. So dodge it. One, two, three. Yeah, we got it, we got it, we got it, got it. Yeah, guys, oh my gosh. This tank build is amazing. I have to study. No problem, Yusuf. No problem, Yusuf. Study, and then you can tell us what you studied. So, the main point of today is finding those stupid things. Uh, which are not those. Should be somewhere else, but I can't find. Basically, we need to find a giant spider. Don't ask me where it is, because I got no idea. And I can't open this one. Ah, there is the thing we need to get. Okay, so we need to get there. I don't know how, but yeah, we, got, we need to get there, basically. Oh my gosh, where the hell do you come out from? Wait, 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 what the hell was that? Wait, 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 don't die like this, man, just because I was doing an experiment. This makes no sense, anyway. Alright, get this thing to work. So, Yusuf got a study today, what are you studying anyway, man? You gotta tell us later. You gotta tell us. So over here there was a big monster that for some reason seems to have disappeared. And apart from that I don't see anything else apart from those mannequins. Uh, okay, so I assume we either are in the wrong place. Or either I am missing something. Let me see, here I can't get down. Here I can't either. So unless there is some secret thing over here, and there is not, we need to find another way to get to that point. Okay, let me show you how to counter-attack. Now, as soon as this guy comes up, I'll show you how to counter-attack in me. Hey. Man. Man, do you, this counter-attack is not working anymore. Oh, please. Man, the counter-attack is not working. Nah, it's not working at all. And I basically wasted all of my resources for this thing. There you are. So easy it was. So damn easy. Okay, guys, I need a lot more elixirs for this. I can't make it otherwise. I can't make it otherwise. Anyway, at least now we know where we need to go. I guess. Yeah. Wait. I sense there is something. Yeah. Yeah, this was pretty much it. So let me save back again. Again. Cool, 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 cool. Thanks for the four elixirs. Wow, it's the noble place. Why did we get four this time? There you are. Two, and he's gone. Ametre, you said you stream RPGs today. Yeah, man, I knew by yesterday in the end I didn't do the Neo one, so I had to go back to it. I'm really sorry, man, but this game is actually too, too, too cooking like once you start to play you need to finish the thing you basically did and otherwise you get uh, you get like no stress but you feel like you want to play more I don't know how to explain that anyway I truly believe oh yesterday we can play tomorrow I mean we can play that for sure man tomorrow we will play the other game apart from that I got no idea where we need to go right now Oh, not here for sure. Well, actually, what I like of those spiders is that they actually leave you, like, a lot of time to, to do your things. And 
here I sense a yaokai. So yaokai. Oh, this is an easy one. Oh shit. Okay, okay. Okay, I, I was joking. Maybe you're not that easy. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Shit, shit. Well, sorry, but I really don't like the game. Oh, don't worry, man. <laughs> All right, man. I'll see you tomorrow then. So, what the hell? How come I kill that? Wow, this is like... Damn it. So, we need to dodge the eggs, otherwise they spawn some more creatures. Need to get in here and kill this one, which of course was waiting for us. Hey, 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 what the heck? Yes, this is all we needed. Let's go back to take our grave, which was here, I believe. Where is the spider though? There has to be a spider nearby. Hey, hey, hey. Let me show you something over here. Let me show you something. Hey, 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 what the hell? Ah, I see. The other one was there. How come that... Hey, what the hell, man? This is not fair. Alright, alright. Wow. We almost died in here, luckily enough, thanks to this build, I, I'm, most of the time I managed to dodge, because I have a lot of kills. I should have waited, so. Okay, this is our time to attack. Yes, we managed. So let's go outside. And here we go. Good job OP, hi Aski, how are you doing man? We have almost made it through this mission, I bet that the boss is not that far. I can bet. And here we go outside. Don't know what this place is, but we got Kodama. Yes, this is a Kodama. Alright, in the meantime guys, let me know what you did today. And what I did today was basically going shopping I played a little bit on you and now I'm here with you to show at uh, which point did I get did I get to so there is another secret path in here no we get only another chance to get back in which is not as cool as getting out so let me see if there is anything behind this oh whoa, whoa, what the hell come here it's another spider. Okay, guys, we did pretty much all of them. So I'm sure that here there is. You got the key to the castle gates. Is this something important? Oh, 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 oh. We got something important though, yeah. So I found the key to the gate. Yes! I don't know the new update on Ark and it was uh, in a restaurant, the steak was very good. Oh my gosh, man, that sounds about extremely nice. So yeah, well done for that, man. How How is the new Ark update? Are you enjoying it? Okay, remember, in Neo you always need to kill your enemies, otherwise they, they will just carry on following you all the time, all the time. Anyway, we got it, we just need to go upstairs now. Wow, and we found an elixir. Cool. Oh my gosh, guys. Anyway, do you like Neo, guys? I actually am in total love with it. I can't express how much I like this game, even though it's so difficult and annoying. Okay, now the rock is coming. There you are, the rock will take care of him. As I said. So yeah, you're in a restaurant where the steak was extremely good. That's very good to hear. Actually, I'm a big fan of steaks too. Okay, this time you didn't get us with your stupid attack. Oh crap. Oh, 
Alright. Oh man, I, I knew, I knew that I should have dodged. Hey, what the hell? So, come, come here, come here. We got him. Alright, we paired it. Oh, this is the time to attack because he cannot fight back, basically. And this is it, guys. We did it again. Oh my gosh. So that's super cool. We got another elixir. We got an official spear. Don't ask me what that is because I don't know. But yeah, what matters is that we are here where I couldn't manage to get before. I think, at least, that this is the point where I couldn't get before. Yes, oh my gosh, so much experience. And today, anyway, we're going to build the ninjutsu, the ninjutsu build for that. Those should be the gates. Yes, this was how to get into the gates of the castle. And here we have an altar to pray to. So amazing, so amazing. So let me see what, which Kodama did we actually receive before. We got Kodama, no? So Kodama blessing, yeah. We didn't get the healer one. I think we, we got the increases weapon drape I yeah. So it wasn't the, the the actual nice and useful one. No a chance. Plus now we just need to go down here. And I bet well, I bet that this is basically super easy to kill this guy. The shand okay, this seems pretty tough, so we can't make Hey, what the hell, you were close. Oh, whoop. This was cool, this was cool. A player changed your, changed the name of one of your groups. What the hell is that? Oh my god, free PSN card. <laughs> Who the hell is this guy? Wait guys, oh my gosh, I just got it. Just go down. Yes, he did. As a matter of fact, he went down. Alright guys, so all we need to do right now is to shoot this thing and turn on our special attack. We will get him in a second and we will get the last of the things we actually need. Hey, 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 hey! Oh my gosh, this didn't work as intended. It worked! Nobunaga, I will never let you use a trophy to grow your power. Ah, alright. So, okay, I think we got all the pieces of it. So, it's very nice, Bojan, thanks for asking. Uh, we are, I'm actually doing a super research job with Neo. I think I'm getting good at this game. I do think there is a path to go up to over here. Oh, what the hell are you, Joe? Oh my gosh, I fell down there. <sighs> Guys, I really hope that my my thumbstone, my tombstone is still there. Otherwise, I'm screwed. Otherwise, I'm literally screwed. Guys. Yeah, pretty much. Just go down. Oh no, our tombstone is still there. Can I get down or oh, up? Okay, I need to go up. Yes. So let's get this guy to go down again. Hopefully this time he's dead. Let's see. Pff, again. What the hell? Just go down and stay there, man. Yeah. Thank you. Back. Very nice, Aski. Before I actually fell. That sounds like stupid. Half stupid, half crazy, but yeah. I, I fell. Yeah. Long story short, I fell. And I fell without actually opening this one, which which is the only thing I should have done, basically. So yeah, let's open this thing. Oh, whoa, whoops. Yeah. And uh, yeah, there just is another spider. Well guys, I think at this point the game is getting easy actually, the game is getting easy, I think I came to a level, oh Yusuf is back too, 
which uh, so I wait why is this I thought it was a pass to go up well no big deal anyway now I just don't know what I need to do with all the things I got and I got plenty of them I got plenty of things and I don't know how to use them so over here there should be a demon somewhere he is. Yes. And there you go. So now I don't know what we need to do with the things I got. I was saying, did you pick up the top four subs of the week? Tomorrow the top four subs will be sh will be basically the top four subs video. Yeah, it's coming tomorrow. So yeah, there is still is time to make up my mind. And anyway, the items they got, they should be key items. Now, I'll key to the gates, Hiragumo, Fragment 4. What do I actually possibly need the Fragment 4? Weapons, armor, key items. It has to be one of those, so I have all the five of them. One of the scattered from the that was scattered by this master, Matsakuna Danyo. Whatever it is, whatever it is. Oh ho ho guys, another cool thing, apart from getting spitted by spiders, uh, and apart from the fact that we just dodge a super dangerous attack, it's just that we are about to level up. Tell me if this is not one of the coolest thing ever. Okay, so we got the thing to level up our ninjutsu, which is the thing I am trying to level up the most, because it gives me it gives me a lot basically, it gives me a lot and uh, it gives me most of all skill ninja points just one what a, what a, what a terrible thing anyway anyway for anyway I bet we gotta go up now I bet oh, I think at least now come here rock is incoming and we dodged it plus let me aim again to this guy and let me see if we actually need to go a path above all right one two three and dodge wow he never used this attack against me first time i see this actually This time he dodged. Yeah, man, you better be careful to whatever you do. Oh, he's out. Shit, 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 shit. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Yes. This should be enough. Shit. Shit. Wait, 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 wait. What is this? Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. So we made this happen. Let me see. Okay, gotta go. Bye. Don't forget the six vids. Oh, thanks for reminding me, man. I'll try. I'll try to do as many videos as possible. How was your Rocket League game, anyway, Bajan? I'm pretty much just playing Neo lately. Wait, what is this? Okay, over there, there is a Yaokai, so let me go back up, because I, I think there is something we can possibly do up here. Ah, uh, yes, totally. Why the hell? What? What the hell? Okay, we actually dodged a lot of fire over here. Alright, 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 alright. Let me level up a little bit more. Yes, this was enough to destroy him. Anywho, what was that hard thing on your comment? I didn't know there was such a feature similar to like but different. Yeah, basically you can put your fa one of your favorite comments in the top 
and uh, as I was away for shopping I actually didn't have time to reply unfortunately so I just pressed that in order to make the thing quicker and uh, yeah I was thinking to reply later on and uh, that's pretty much the feature is really cool man and uh, apart from it being cool we actually need to destroy this spider one more time all right so bear with me Bojan and anyway what else did you say oh my game is good almost 11 hours on record yeah man Rocket League is like so it. Hey, 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 how come that this spider actually got to us? Oh my gosh. Anyway. Anyway. We got the spider, so let's use straight away this thing. This is all this is all you basically need to, to do once you find this spider. And as you can see, we nailed it. Guide Kodama to Shrine. We got also the latest Kodama. I'm coming back. No problem, no problem, Husky, no problem. Alright, so we got all the six of them. All the six Hiraguno fragments. Hiraguno. Pretty cool. Let me just go back. Save to the nearest shrine because I, I can sense a boss is incoming. Even scattered to PC, he kept such a strong spirit within. I don't understand why this cat is always following us. I must say that they are both worth some inspiration. Well, if they say so. Ooh, I totally forgot about this guy. And I. But I totally remember that this thing that. He should be weak to water anyway. Alright. Alright, we did it, we did it. Let's go to see if there is a boss awaiting for us. Thing that I really think. Okay, we got it. In this game you basically learn the basic of archery. Law of archery and a lot of nonsense basically apparently oh my gosh oh wow so yeah this game actually is also good for jump scare apparently cool beans though cool beans so paladin season one update coming out today tomorrow i'm grinding go for them all the time oh wait you get 30 gems per win max 90 today tomorrow just and uh, wait a minute, what happens once the new season starts, man? Because I got no clue about what what does that implies, actually. Check. Check, 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 check. What the hell? Just dodge it. Yeah, just dodge it, just dodge it again. Oh my gosh, we, we go out of this for miracle. Yeah, this is how you basically do it. Plus, I probably we need to go upstairs, get a key for the, the thing that was down there, and then we will meet a boss. I'm really looking forward to see it. Oh, oh, oh there is a little demon over right here. Oh, he finally decided to do his attack. All right. Oh, ho, 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 he's down. Yes, this is all we actually needed. So if we fall, there is something I won't like. All right, come near. Plus guy, I just discovered a new feature. Hi, Toxic Gamer, how are you, man? Oh, there is a little Kodama over here. Wait, how do I get to him, though? Ah, there must be a way to fall for him from above. Ah, uh, yeah, something like this, but just at the above. 
All right, guys, there is something here. I can sense it. I can sense it. The boss is incoming. Whoa. Holy crap. What the hell? All right, guys, first time I see this thing going on. I just know that as a first step I need to put this one down. Yeah, she got hit, so now she will be tremendously slow. Then let me give her a little bit of poison. That unfortunately doesn't last for the whole game. Just another one. Hey, she actually hit them. Okay, she got hit again. So now she should be a little bit slower. All right, guys. All right. I don't know what she's doing. Why is she walking like this? Okay, now I get it. She was doing like a street dance move. Oh, she's she's out of this thing. This is the right attempt. This is the right time to attack her. Oh ho ho! Hey, 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 you didn't do this before. Alright. So. Oh, she's again in this, in, in the street dance mode. And this time we can simply get her by carry on attacking. That's pretty cool. Oh shit, this time she got us. But anyway, she doesn't have much. Okay, let me let me go full Let me go full power over here guys. Let me go full power. I don't think she stands a chance if we carry on like this. Come on. Guys, I got on the first go. I can't believe it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Yes, we did it guys, I can't believe it. Guys, this is the first time I actually beat a mission and a boss at the first time like this. This was a miracle. So anyway, huge update, new legendary car system, totally game changing, new currency, new game on with two new maps, some new some more new stuff, let's see how it goes. Okay, then I'm really looking forward for the for you as well. Anyway guys, we were overpower in this game. Overpower. She didn't remove as much. I basically wanted the first go. Wow, I didn't even know what she was actually weak to or whatever. Crazy. Crazy. Let's go forward. Shin <laughs> 
Бутака. Васи ну куто, данжо то дему югаю. Wow. Well, uh, something about this game is that I don't get the story of it. Guys. I totally don't get the story, the plot, or whatever it comes with. Anyway, Spider Nest Castle. Uh, if Master Namoso recognizes you, what wow, this guy looks like a monkey. You so too do I. Lo Leyazu has departed Ido on his campaign to destroy Uesugi. He should just be arrived at Kyoto right about now. I suggest you to go and join him there. Hanzo, you'll forgive me if I chose not to accompany Sir Anjin. My heart simply can't take it. If they say the clever, avoid danger. The ability hidden tea house has been unlocked. So Hada and thanks for clicking on this video guys, today we are going to see how to unlock the actual hidden tea house. In order to do that, you actually just need to complete the mission Spider Nest Castle, which is a level 47 mission, so it will come later on in the story, when you are about of one quarter, one quarter of completion of the game. So as soon as you will be at the Spider Nest Castle, beat the mission, see the, the actual um, cutscene and so on, and then you will have this message, this message. The ability hidden tea house has been unlocked. Press confirm, mission change uh, shouldn't matter too much, and then as soon as you get to a starting point, you should see hidden tea house available. Let's see what this is actually about. You will see Donjo, which is uh, basically, I don't know, <laughs> It's always nice to see a customer. This theorem is my pride and joy, a place that straddles our realm, the other world. But I suspect that you have realized this already. I hear that you have taken to playing that being a warrior. But warriors fight not for himself. His efforts are all for the good of his clan. Perhaps it is time you joined one too. Now look into my Hiragumo Kero. There we go. And basically with this one you can join a clan, let's say that a clan is something like, I don't know, like the Uchiha clan in Naruto, they all come with some special thing they can give you. And I don't understand the blue or the blue or red thing, I just assume that the red, the red is basically the evil ones, <laughs> I think, if you actually have any other idea what the blue and the red stands for, just let me know, but any actual a clan comes with some perks so some of them for example they come with water some bow damage so in case you want to actually do a lot of damage with the bow the mohri is better let's analyze all of them the otani so this will give you a lot of more amrita if you're using the um, ally amrita goes so maybe it's just when you play multiplayer Oh, this is not clear. Anyway, this basically gives you more Amrita and you receive less elemental damage. Yokai close combat, enemy defense lowered in the grapple way. Status elements relieved, elixir used. So basically using an elixir actually cures you from poison, burn or any other thing. This is amazing. Damage reduction. A lot more as well. Then there is the Kato, damage reduction when attacking. So. While you are attacking, you get less damage. And at the same time, you get some earth more damage. Close combat, camp about to fall. Uh, okay, so when somebody is about to fall, if you attack them, you will remove more. And you have a lot more key regeneration. Close combat attack, red demon armor. Uh, if you actually, uh, if you actually, if you actually have equipped that kind of armor, you will have a more close combat attack. And you, you will also have some more toughness, but you always need to use the same red demon arm. The Shima, close, uh, close, um, well, the close combo will basically uh, deal more damage if they are affected by a status, and you will have more proficiency. Past records, last time, before last time, are uh, really numbers that shouldn't matter. 
the water bowl we already seen it this was the mori which is super cool if you're a ninja i guess if you're a ninja the water and the bow damage they could actually do a pretty good deal they could actually be a pretty good deal for you so no key consumption while guarding that's cool oh that's amazing actually 10% of no key consumption so i guess that you would be basically you will be basically have a chance to no lose key while you are guarding if somebody attacks you of course on online ally recovery death i guess that with this one you can resurrect people when they die that's pretty cool but it just works for online stuff evasion attack boost 12% guys this is actually extremely useful if you play online and if you need to to help a friend or so and there are so many clans you can actually see wow so in this case the kuroda sounds cool close combat attack and hand cannon damage is what it gives you damage held full life okay okay skill damage sounds cool too Kayu Dama and Horoku Dama damage bonus. Close combat attack. Lightning damage. The Chachibana sounds cool. And the key reduction. When you are affected by some status like fire or poison. Key. You'll have more key. And more damage from behind. Extremely useful for ninjas. Ah, but I don't use a lot of damage from behind. No key consumption. And living weapon attack enhancement. Wow. So this seems extremely powerful. Close combat attack. I actually was just looking for if there is something that can avoid you using ninjutsu. So Amrita earned from enemies, money earned from enemies. This is extremely helpful in order to level up. I think I'm going with this one. View ranking. Uh, well, basically there are... Um, wow. So provisional rank. The Toyomi is the one used the most. The white and red. That's super cool. So I guess that all those people are using the Toyomi. Yeah, because if, if it actually gives you 10%, it means that if you would get something like a 100 Amrita, you would get 110, 1000, 1100, and so on, and so on. So this, I guess, is extremely cool to level up faster, and I think it will be the one I will go for. Let's see which is the, the last one. The, the second one is the Furuta. Let's go to check the Furuta later. Prevent deaths as long as you are not in a critical condition. Wow, this seems pretty cool too. Damage nullified. Okay, so we actually visit those ones, but there are a lot more. Status relieved, elixir use. Close combat attack, toughness. No key consumption. Cool, online ally recovery. The Horokudama damage. Well, guys, I. this is actually pretty cool if you want to tank your character life bonus when in an ally's camp. Okay, so this is actually useful just when you're helping other people. Close combat dash attack bonus, always cool for ninjas and spear users, or even any the other any other user that needs to use the dash. Uh, plus, guys, there are some of them that, that basically are more helpful when you are helping someone. Luck silver tongue, the silver tongue. I got no idea what it is, but luck seems pretty cool. With the Furuta, which is the second one used, you basically get more luck of finding around more helpful stuff. Enemy blindness extended, reduced stat element. No, basically, guys, I'm just looking for something that enhances your chances to never basically use uh, the ninjutsu. So if I can find that, I'll use that one. Otherwise, I'll go for the one that gave you more Amrita change to life attack there actually are so many so many attacks this is perfect for spear users murakami luck seems cool human close combat increased mission rewards not really important high extense attack allies healed what is this self and allies healed enemy defeated in close combat oh cool and life recovery so guys anyway i need to level up fast Therefore, I will go for that one that actually gave you a lot of Amrita. Basically, we, we have anyway seen all of them. And uh, yeah, the one you choose to actually get 
mostly depends on the on which results you want to achieve but in my case as i need to to level up fast i don't care about those monies but the, the 10 percent earned from enemies is amazing this will will basically boost you up super fast you cannot change your allegiance of line class you are like clans you are allied to are managed by at the player account seems cool are you sure you want to pledge a allegiance to toyomi yeah i would love it the clan battle information is being updated please wait a moment super cool clan battles transfer view information regarding clan battles transfer change which clan you are aligned to this is basically what you need to do to change allegiance trade glory for items well it seems cool and uh, well in clans you can basically also purchase skins like those ones you can now transform this into a revenant i want these guys i want these you are about to obtain an uncommon or rare sword wow well as i use the spear how much glory do i have 2000 oh it's a lot so let me get some spear yes i got this one which is <laughs> danger is quite funny so that's super cool parry strong attack key damage low guard and so on and so on. i like it I i'm happy so add to inventory yes and uh, well there are a lot more things that you can actually get you can get masterpieces or gestures you can actually purchase gestures too this is crazy bring it on seems pretty cool but what i would like the most is actually changing my skin to the revenant i would love to have that is the revenant thing so i'll get more glory for that and apart from that you can actually wow place a signal where you are where where you are and on your count pass it indicates which way you need to go imbued with the power of Jin jizo bodosatsu who protected china from an early death it is designed to keep people on the right path this seems cool this is cool that it doesn't cost much oh my gosh this is pretty cool the Ochoko. this is how you can buy them and also the hunk of yokai hair which gives you it should give you something i ah, know is a material used for the blacksmith i thought it was giving you some special kind of ability or something like that anyway uh i'll just wait for the revenant thing and uh, this will be pretty much it the ranking i think here we can see the ranking things yeah the toyomi is basically yeah this is what the the, the most of the people use transforming your opinion to that of another character yeah in this one this is what we should actually need would this is what we would actually do if we would have purchased the actual revenant thing i will get the revenant like as up anyway and i hope that with the season pass more skins are incoming but this was basically let's see a little bit what dandra has to to say speak to dandra i want to know more well actually no this is basically giving you random information speak to danjo a doppelganger appeared before you you say <laughs> there was presumably a visitor they must have lost their way in the yokai realm and found themselves at your side a visitor cannot usually be seen even by you though you can see me so you did not in fact see one you sensed their presence which manifested itself as the person you know most yourself what does at least they appear as someone good looking supposed to mean you flatter yourself too much for you this was cool anyway this is how you unlock the clan battles i don't know what update stands for we can totally try what happens if you actually click on update but this is what clans are for the clan battle information is being updated yeah this is just to see the battle between clans and it's not it's not a big deal so this is how you get the clans feature unlocked and that's pretty much it guys so i hope you will have fun using your clan choosing the correct one if you need any suggestion on which one you should pick think about what you are actually using and what you are planning to to need if you are somebody that shoots from distance the bow and water thing was extremely cool otherwise go for the Amrita one or for the luck one those three are the best so this was everything let me know which clan you picked in the comments below 
and for anything else i will remain here at your disposal for any question or whatsoever i'll see you soon for another video then cheers and yeah so well we actually unlocked the hidden tea house that's pretty cool let's go to the shrine and level up so try it was sword sometime i wonder what they can do i prank the whoa hey blue blazer whoa, what are you doing man man i want to change my thing so isonate was doing was giving me a lot of life more this will give us a lot of luck more wow so we will get less life cool but at least we will have 20 percent protection which always is 20 percent i think itokori wow itokori anyway um this is pretty cool i would say is giving us um luck and actually this is extremely cool we would need a level 16 for get all the benefits of it well no big deal anyway now with the luck we are supposed to get a lot more so yeah boj and i'll try now this one and blue blazer do you actually have neo man okay i guess we can level up this thing dexterity yes now we have 11 i don't even know i don't i didn't even see what we got out of it that seems pretty cool main mission falling snow the battle of hohashi i go gesture neo stands book of reincarnation i totally need this i find hard to believe myself but it seems that a giant ghost has appeared at the okashi bridge and is attacking those who cross and stealing their weapons if if it were a yaokai that would be one thing but how can a ghost attack people william will you get to the bottom of this for me of course i would nope are you planning to get it if you ask for my opinion it's totally worth it man it's totally worth it so go and get it man go and get it you won't regret it at all at all man anyway we're going to do some more tutorials over here today i need to do i need to do at least four tutorials we did already the tea house one so what i'm about to do is the actual um let's say can you trick shot in this game well you can shoot arrows but what do you mean by trick shot man so let me just do this tutorial really quickly hi there and thanks for clicking on this video guys today we are here to actually check how do you cast spells in neo so this is what you need to do if and i'm saying only if you don't have one of those items in uh, your actual um, inventory and uh, i by by this item i mean one of the actual talismans they're called talisman you should be able to see them in a bit as soon as i can basically find them let me just search where the hell are they gone let me go here so oh they're called actually amulets so look for one of those for example the wind amulet the earth amulet and the water amulet okay equip them as a shortcut in this one or for example the moment talisman which is the one that actually looks like a spell the most if you can't get them of course just do as follows go in learn skills go in omnio magic in order to get some omnio magic points you need to actually increase the omnio magic status when you are at a, at a shrine and you basically will need to purchase one of those as you can see here there is the talisman fire water and this will always give you some talisman amulet basically so you'll get wind earth shadow run and you will have more and more and more like the resistance you will have the divination basically by learning these you will have um more talismans this one is the one that should give you the moment ones which we are going to use so we are basically going to use two of them the earth and the moment one you will see how they attack the first one will basically imbue your spear or whatever else weapon you are actually using and it will give you a special 
um, how can you say a power up yeah so if we spawn this one for example which is a damn level 72 how come he died over here wow he's actually using the dual sword so as you can see this actually gave us some special status now if you use the other one instead this is going to summon your spirit in my case this is a spider and this is how the thing will be basically working this spider is extremely cool but yeah you can use you can just use one of them at a time if you bring your opponent here he should get slowed down so remember the moment talisman will also will always give you some something extremely cool apart from the attack you're actually using and yeah this is basically all you need to do in order to cast the spells just equip them set them as a shortcut and uh, you should be good to go and uh, basically summon your creatures and use all the spells you can possibly need so in this case he he should now he should have now got uh, ultra loads but no because it didn't actually touch this thing but usually when you cast the the moment talisman to summon your spell usually you actually have an animal that attacks them and usually does most of the damage this is just a special spell and the spell will always change uh, depending on which guardian spirit you have actually chosen and that's pretty much it so yeah give it a try equip all the talisman you need there are different ones there is one that gives you more resistance to damage there is one that gives you a power up on um on actual yeah our was <laughs> yeah there is one that actually gives you more resistance to damage there is one that gives you more attack there is one that gives you some specific power ups and so on and so on hey oh my gosh is what with that Anyway, this is how the talismans and everything else works. Let me know which one you are using, let me know if this guide was helpful, and if you need anything else, I will be always here waiting for your comments. So have a great one ahead, and I will be seeing you soon. Take care then. Cheers. Alright, this is basically the fail of the day. We tried to kill the 72 the, the level 72 spirit and he basically destroyed us and what what is even more embarrassing is that yeah i lost most of my talisman for fighting that guy which i actually never use what the hell by the way did you see that now the enemies are never removing much life from us what the hell just dodge it Yeah, this is exactly what you need to do, guys. Alright, this one is ours. Let me try something. Okay, I just need more. There you are. This is what you basically get. We got an Ochoko and a Warrior of the West. So I think I'm going to get for all of them now. And yeah, in the meantime guys, you can tell me uh, how, how is basically going for you. So Toxic Gamer is here. How? How what, man? Hey, 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 this guy has a lightning spear. This is not normal. And this is totally not what I wanted. I wanted an elixir. So it's basically a water fight against a fire one. What the hell? Well guys, this guy is extremely strong. Wow, this should have actually drained all of his things. Oh damn. Oh, this was pretty cool. 
All right, guys. Let me just try to get this guy going. Shit. All right. Apparently, if one, if one of your attacks goes through, yeah. All you need to do. Yeah, this is exactly what I meant by it. Alright, luckily enough I have a lot of key. And I can carry on as much as I want to parry. Wow. How can this guy be so tough to beat? Okay, let me do the same thing again. Come here. Wait, how come? Just let me destroy you. Yeah, this is all you need to do in this case. Let me recover a little bit of key. We did it. Super cool. So we just need to destroy the ghosts. Wait, where is the shrine? Guys, there is no shrine over here. Oh, damn. Alright, I was actually pointing everything on the shrine, but there is no time for that. So I, I was never coming again. Oh, I see the joke. Nico, do you also follow Frog Leap Studios? He is even more famous than Preview One Rock. I do, I do. When will I start Subnautica? Hey, man, that's an actual good question. Wait, what is this thing? Is it the enemy? Guys, I don't trust this guy. He's doing something. He's up to something. Oh my gosh! He has a super power up over here. Wait, I'm sure this is actually the guy we need to fight. And I got a little surprise for him. Another one? Yeah. Come here, come here. So yeah, shoot us as much as you want. Carry on. Yeah, just carry on. Yeah, he goes low. So yeah. This should be the ghost anyway. Okay, let me get a little bit more poison. And slowly we should get him. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, now let, 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 uh, let him just kill us. Because uh, basically I wasted all of my elixir, so there was actually not a chance that we could have beaten him. So it's the man from Friday the 13th game, but in all times, yeah. And he's just using an axe instead of whatever he usually uses, I guess. So we got our thing back. Let's destroy this idiot. Alright, so I guess that to beat this guy we just need to do this technique. Let's just carry on until we actually get him. Should take a little bit, but yeah, this is uh, the technique I think he is using. So let him come. Whatever he's using, basically. Alright, now is our time to attack. Damn, he's always pairing, guys. Okay, luckily enough, I have a lot of key. He's always pairing, my gosh. 
this is what you get, you bastard. Oh, damn. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, actually, this is something that one should be able to beat without the, without using a single elixir, but this is not what happening here. Yes, this is all we needed. This is a boss, basically. Oh my gosh. He's going for, for the attack of it. Okay, so is it me or this thing is requiring extra patience? Yeah, so just come here. Yeah, he actually requires a lot. What the hell? Wow, he died. How come he's parrying all the time, guys? Okay, anyway. Oh, wow. Wait, 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 this is not fair, guys. What the hell is this thing? No, 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 no. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. How come? How come he summoned those things? Okay, anyway, we should have now a special enhancement for our weapon. Yes, exactly what I was talking about. Alright guys, we are basically piercing him all the time. And not only this, he almost got us, because I am out of elixirs. Alright, this is our time to attack. Alright, this should be the, the right technique to use. Dodge, 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 man. Okay. Okay, guys, I think we can do it. Let him come. When he's about to attack, I will just retreat. Oh my gosh, this was a close call. Alright, let's wait for the time. Yes. No. Oh my gosh. Okay, let him attack then. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh, this was close. Yes. Okay, guys, we almost did it. Yes, we did it. I can't believe it. This was harder than what it actually looked like. I can totally tell you that. Go forward, the mission is over. When will I start Subnautica? Very soon, man. I will restart Subnautica. You can connect your PS4 to PC or laptop wirelessly, Nico. I do? And uh, so you think I can play the games from there? That would be cool, man. But how do you actually do it? You need to do it on uh, online, I assume, no? Hmm, so that was it. This smells like the work of the man who came from your distant land in pursuit of you. To toy with even our greatest ancestors. Just how far will he go to make a fool of this country, William? On behalf of the land of the rising sun, I thank you. So we got the gestures and we had a lot more. We also got a little bit of Amrita, which never hurts. Wow, guys, okay, this was so close. This was such a close call. Such a close call. Let's go for the next mission anyway. Main mission one was covered the spiral castle. The falling is no no. How strange to see snow falling in June. Well pretty much. We must do something before the capital completely freezes over. The cold is coming from Honoi Temple. Rumor also has that a woman's cries echo from the structure every night. Will you look into it, William? Do we have a chance? Do we have a choice, I was wondering. There is also an offline one. 
for, for doing well for connecting your PS4 to the PC you mean man if there was wow how do you do it so make how do you actually do it man? it would be extremely interesting in doing such a thing man extremely interest did okay the Hunoi thing wasn't important so I just skipped it and here we go there is a shrine what a dreadful curse Wow. So here we go at the level up. We don't have anything more. We are going to do another another tutorial. How to cast ninjas. Hello and thanks for clicking on this video, guys. Today we're actually here to see how do you cast a ninjutsu. Ninjutsu actually has a multiple way to be casted. Like you can cast those shurikens. You can cast some of those that basically slow down the enemies and is extremely useful and there are a lot more and more and more but how do you actually cast them so first of all you need to make sure that in your item you have one of those uh, they, they can be called in different way kunai's shuriken makibishi they might be broths and so on and so on if you don't have them you need to go and learn skills in ninja and actually purchase one of those like in the top you can see the shuriken and uh, then you will have more and more and more anyway once you will have them you will be basically able to um, create them in one of the different shrines which are around the missions you usually do or from the starting points go in ready jutsu and from here you can actually craft all the ones that you have purchased once you actually did that just make sure to go in uh, in your items from the menu and to equip them setting them as a shortcut in this way then you will have them in your inventory and all you will need to do is pressing the correspondent key in order to cast them and in this way you got an injury for the shurikens is exactly the same thing just aim and throw your wonderful ninjutsu this is all you need to basically do forget for casting your ninjutsu it doesn't take anything else well guys i hope this this guide was helpful if it was or it wasn't just let me know in the comments below and for anything else i will remain at your disposal so i'll make sure to read all the comments and to reply to them so for today this is everything and uh, i'll see you soon for another guide then catch you later then cheers and another guide was done guys i can't believe how easy it is to actually recall from the ps4 Download the app on the PC, enter your PS username and device connecting number from your PS4. And this will allow you to do the offline thing too. In that case, man, it sounds super amazing. This place itself seems to be enchasing some strange kind of energy. We may learn something if we trace it back to the source. Yeah, I'm sure that we basically need to destroy or do something about it, basically. Anyway, what was this noise like if some enemy was around? Nico, I think you should change your style of thumbnails, because that blast of his on is getting kind of old. You mean, uh, which one do you mean? The latest one? Yeah, man, I still need to actually make the thumbnails for, for those. Oh my gosh, this guy is the first one that doesn't die when I shoot him. Okay. Okay, we did it. So yeah, in the last ones I'm going to make the thumbnails for those right now, as soon as this stream actually finishes. By the way, as you can see guys, I totally think that I need to go to a shrine like a zap. Because as you can see, the enemies are quite resistant to my weapons. Anyway, let me do something else. What could I actually do? Oh, actually, there was the counter-attack thing, but it's not working today. Don't even ask me why. But yeah, it's not working. 
Anyway, let me do how to build dual katanas. In this way, it will be extremely useful. I wanted to do the guide for every, every single item I can possibly get. For every single build that actually exists, I wanted to say. So actually, let me check if I have a dual katana to use. The Uchigatana. This is actually the strongest one we have. I'll use it instead of the armor that I never use. Okay, let me see a little bit how it goes. Wow. I thought it was faster though. Let me change it to fast instance. Wow. It seems pretty, pretty fast. Yeah, but as you can see, it removes no damage. What the hell? Wow, this is, is extremely cool, guys. You basically give no, not a chance to the opponent to move. Wow, Bojan, are you actually seeing this? He meant the explosion on any good thumbs. Oh, really? I actually like it. Again, okay, he has finished the shooting. Guys, how come that this fucker is not dying? Wow. So let me try again. Wow. Man, do you see how fast is the katana? Okay. Wow, this is so cool. Okay, high distance. All right, the high distance is extremely cool. I'm in total love with it, guys. I'm in total love with it. Oh, oh, oh. So let me see if I can counterattack. I think it's something for the mid. Man, this thing is not working anymore, I swear. And this thing is not working anymore. It's not a matter of, of not having stuff. Because I actually still have all of my key. Now is that is not working at all. Ah it's not working guys. Anyway for anyway. The spear, as you can see, is my best, my best, 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 best friend. Dual swords are my fast. He's extremely fast. Alone besiege, so with source insult him right to rock, leave pain the town right for free. How did you do it, man? Do you actually download them at the latest versions? Because that would be pretty awesome. Anyway. We need to recover it and to basically give some advices for the skills for the dual katana because actually lately I have been studying which are the best thing you can possibly get for your um, for your build and for, for all of those and uh, yeah I got pretty much very informed about it so this is how I managed to get a little bit better to the game I went to the wiki and yeah I read pretty much everything pretty much everything and uh, yep 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 so let me just check something over here the spear yeah there should be one thing called yeah it's not this one it was a mid one it was in the mid stance only it's not this one it's not this one it is in the mid stand only no, I was still there checking them. Mistance only. Seeing this is exactly what should happen, man. The twirl. What the hell? Man, how come that is not working? Let me go to skill customization. 
mid stance. Yeah, the twirl. Man, I got it. What the hell? I got it, but it's not working for some strange, stupid reason. Ah, damn it. Guys, this stupid twirl is not working anymore. Stupid twirl is not working at all. I'ma tell you, this stupid twirl doesn't work. So let me just aim to this idiot, which never dies when I when I do it from this mission. They never die. So let me get it again. I need to make this thing work, guys. Okay. All right, so far so cool. There is a guy with the spear right by, right beyond it. Guys, did you actually see that? Maybe I think I missed something. Maybe this is low instance only. No, it's not. What the hell? Nah, it never works, guys. It never works. Doesn't matter how you do it, but the counter-attack is broken. I think it's a bug they, late, they, they actually had only lately. Top best for announced tomorrow. Maybe you're doing it wrong. I don't think so. Because actually, you saw the timing was perfect. I don't think so. But yeah, anyway, let's see a little bit together the best builds. So these are the best builds, guys. Let me go in, in the thing where I actually was. Let me actually go there, yes. Let me just go there. Uh, what is it? Build Neo. It was actually super cool. So I'm about to do the best build for Axe, for Dual Katana, and so on and so on. So Magic Mid Stance, Adamantine Axe, Tank. Oh ho ho! Slice. Ah, no, 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 what the fuck is this? Great effects. Build the work of Magic Jutsu. What? This is nothing, what the hell? Yes, this is exactly the build with different weapons. And it doesn't load it. Don't even ask me why. Stats and leveling up primer. Alright, there we go. Hello guys and thanks for clicking on this video today we are here in Neo to actually see a little bit how you should build your axe if you want to build your axe the best way so go in the level up and what you actually need to do is absolutely not follow what is written here because actually this is not the thing I'm using for my axe but I'm basically going to talk you through what you should actually purchase First of all, the axe strength and damage is gained through strength. So make sure to go here and this is the top priority you actually need to top up. So go for a 60% or a 50% of all your points spent in strength. This will make you this will make sure that every time you use the axe you will be basically dealing a huge amount of damage. So go for strength first. Second of all, you know that the um, that wielding the axe, you will be basically need to be a tank as well because you will be slow. So you can go directly for the assassin one and uh, just go full damage, or you totally need to go for body to body. Every time gets you a lot of life, 25 all the time. So 
body is absolutely recommended in order to do not die straight away otherwise if you totally want to be an assassin and you are not afraid of getting a huge deal of damage go for even more strength but if you actually need it and you are a not a massive extreme extremely good dodger because you as you know basically the the axe requires a lot a lot a lot, a lot of time in order to to cast some uh, so some attack of course so actually uh, action some attack so for this reason sometimes you will be hit and when you will get hit you totally want to have some more life and body will give you all the life you need so go for a 20% so let's say go 50% strength because you need a lot of attack power in your actual uh, axe and the strength will also give you the chance to get some more stats from the armors as you can see from here basically the armors the heaviest one which we which you will be using uh, they require some uh, some uh, very strong strength skills so as you can see this one for example in order to get the special effects you will need a lot of body and a lot of strength the special effect you see over there they they don't always get uh, they, they, they don't always work it's not that just because you see the special effects these are working straight away in order to get them work you need to have the requirements like body and strength which are the ones at the bottom of the list if you satisfy those requirements you get the special effects otherwise no you can forget about the special effects so body and strength will be always required when you are actually building your axe so for this reason strength is extremely recommended as well so go 50% strength, go 20% body and stamina because of course you know that uh, actually building up uh, the, um, the, the axe actually requires you a lot a lot a lot of key. So go for stamina, don't go for her because it's pretty much useless and uh, yeah pretty much that's it if you want also to have a little bit more of uh, damage i would suggest you to go for the magic the magic or the spirits or even both of them just giving five percent here five percent here will be basically giving you uh, a lot of spirits in order to get more damage once you will evoke your spirit guardian and some more Omnio magic, so maybe casting some magics through to the animal, like slowing it down and giving to your axe some fire, water, or whatever. This will help you out to deal even more damage. But this is how you should build your axe character. Well, I won't go for the attack so far because if you are using the axe, probably you, you are a tie for the close combat. So just build this as we were saying go for body go for stamina go for strength and just reserve the five percent of your last points to magic and spirits if you don't care about this and you just want to go straight away you could just give like 60 percent here or giving it 25 25 but magic and spirits especially magic but spirit also a little bit just to have the, um, the special things that come with all your spirits because every spirit actually has some stats that you are going to get the same thing as the armors in order and in order to get them you need to level up the spirit part so this is how you should build your axe guys and in this way you won't have problems wielding the heaviest the heaviest weapons thanks to the stamina you will always have space uh, in your inventory to to move fast and to do not consume most of the key and in this case you will have only basically takes so guys i hope this build will help you out if it will or you want just let me know and uh, if there is any other information you would like to to basically ask just let me know in the comments below and i'll make sure to reply to every single one of you so this was everything for today and i'll see you soon i guess cheers So yeah guys, this is basically how you build the axe, I've been studying it a lot and between all the people studying it and using it, the axe for me is a little bit too slow, but yeah, 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 yeah totally, if you are using the axe, this is the build you should basically get, I, it's just a shame that you can't reshape 
your skills all the time you want because every time you purchase one of the books of reincarnation it gets more expensive so yeah maybe you're doing it wrong it might be a beetle of a bug cockroach what is that or the thing over there is a spider do you want a free ps4 beta uh, for which game this game is called disc jam it's multiplayer and for free sounds good man why not why not and uh, so we did how to cast spells we did how to um, to actually get multiple things maybe you could upgrade skill a bit when you use the spear you need the skill for the axe from what I could see as you always need to go for the tank armors as you can see from here there are not many um, strong armors that require the the actual uh, skill the skill is usually for the armors that are really light the heavy ones and the ones that offer the most the most of uh, the, the ones that basically give you more defense they always require stamina and strength so this is why the axe in this case it goes perfectly well with this type of weapons and yeah so yeah based on um, on the wiki this also is what you need to get and i think he should do spirits yes five percent of spirit is extremely useful too and magic five percent of it but no more no more because actually the spirit you need what what do you need it for you mostly need it in order to learn the skills from here from the omnio magic skill uh, tree and yeah that's pretty much it i don't think that ninjutsu really goes well with the axe because one is extremely for slow things and the other one is for extremely fast and yeah that's why my spear is a medium speed attack so i usually use the spear and then i go straight away for the actual fast ninja things so anyway let me change weapon because actually the dual katanas are so amazing Oh my gosh, I love how fast those are, man. Man, when you get next to, to an enemy and you start to attack them so fast, it's so good. You earn one samurai skill points for the, profi for the proficiency with swords. He basically cannot attack us, guys. Do you see that? It doesn't require... We are not removing much life either, but this is because I don't have the build for it. Otherwise, that would be like extremely cool. Let me see if I can do a sniper shot from here. I should be able to. Wow, sniper shot. Wow, guys, I totally love the, the double skill one. Check how fast this thing is. Okay, it's fast, but when an enemy is attacking you like this. And as you can see with my build, it would be perfect because he's not asking me for much for much um, stamina like in my case it's nothing I think I will build this one maybe my build goes better with the actual axe but I mean total low with the dual katanas too okay let me teach you something over here you don't stand a chance basically yeah this is what I'm saying Oh man, he got us. Okay, let's recover this one because it's not worth to die. Alright guys, as you can see. Wow. Guys, the dual, the dual katanas, they are so cool. Let me change stance though. Wow, as you can see, like we were, we actually managed to do a tremendous amount of damage. So this guy is level 65, it should be an extremely good deal for us. Wow. Okay, you know what? I can't use this one with him. Wow, this guy is using the katana and he's extremely good with it. Try me, try me, come here. Well, basically same technique as before. Use the thing as a shield, some more. 
Well, as you can see, this thing is extremely useful. So basically, I'm using this now as a shield, and it always works. See, and if he comes by, and he basically goes on there, whenever he's trying to attack me, he will be extremely slow for me to dodge. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Shuriken, poison shuriken, one more. There you are, another one for you. You basically are now paralyzed. Alright guys, we are going to get him. Let's go and get him. Oh yes. He's so slow he doesn't stand a chance. Yes guys, as we said it, as we said it. Cool, so basically this is how you do things in Neo. So let me check, do you want a free PS4 beta back? Yes, why not, why not Blue Blazer back? But it doesn't have much distance. Yeah, the fact of the dual katana, yeah. That's a little bit of a shame, but true. That one is terribly true, man, that's terribly true. But I love the spear anyway. And the way I built it, now as you can see I am extremely strong. This plus ninjutsu, wow. I can just say wow. Sneak attack, now let me use. Go, 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 go. Wow, guys, do you actually see how much does this attack removes? Wow. Cool. Wow, guys. If I shouldn't have, if I wouldn't have gone for the actual, um, the actual dual katana, I would have gone thousand times for this. For no, if I wouldn't have gone for the spear, I would have gone for the dual katana thousand times. Oh, I managed to. Perry finally guys, did you actually see this? Hello and thanks for clicking on this video. You are wondering probably how to counter attack in Neo. So this is how you do it. You just need to find an opponent like this, press the, the, the guard button and triangle when he's about to attack you. And as you can see, it works perfectly. Sometimes it won't work with some of the monsters around the map. But you should be able to do it pretty much. And in order to do it, you need to unlock the related skill in every single one of uh, the weapons you are basically using. Not in every single one, it just depends which one you are using. In this case, to use it, I was in mid stance. So no hike, no blow, but middle. It works just with the middle one. And while you are pairing or blocking, if you just press triangle in the right time, he basically does the counter attack. The skill you actually need to learn is this one, so it's called twirl, this one. As you can see, when somebody attacks you, you just use this one and it goes down. And in this way, you can pierce them with an attack that will remove, most of the time, half of his life. And this is all you need to do in order to counter-attack in Neo, guys. I hope this guy will help you out in order to achieve better results with your fights, especially against the Revenants. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So let me know what you guys uh, are using it for and if you have any other question. Apart from that, I will wish you a great day ahead and I'll invite you to like and subscribe. I'll see you then for another Neo Guide in the future. Catch you later then. Cheers. Wow, guys, I can't believe we managed to make this thing work. And uh, so that this gem multiplayer, yeah, man, if you are playing it especially, we could play together, I guess. Yeah, but as you can see, this thing is not always working. Yeah, it doesn't always work with most of the monsters. With this one. Wow, did you actually see this attack? We removed so much. Wow, guys, this attack is extremely OP. There you go. Hey, hey. 
Oh, what the heck? Okay, let me just wait a little bit. Hey, 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 how come he got... Wow, guys, I, I love my combo so much. You can't imagine. Anyway, we're 49, enough to level up and to do another guide on how to wield dual katanas and how to build them. Told you in the beginning to take duels, but you took the damn spear, it's okay. <laughs> yeah, I needed it, because being noob, as you can see, the spear has a lot of range. So I needed it, man, I needed it. Let's do the dual katanas, uh, the dual katanas wield thing on you. Can you combine magic, light, water and electricity? Ah, uh, no, that one you can't, you can't. You can just combine your weapon with just one element, I'm afraid. Alright. So, we are here for the best dual katanas and dual swords build. Hi there, and thanks for clicking on this video, guys. Today, if you are here, is because you're probably wondering which stats you should actually improve in order to get the most out of your dual katanas so what you need to increase in uh, basically is here go to the shrine go to your stats and don't copy what i selected all right because in this in this uh, game i don't have them increase the way you should actually increase them so i'm going to talk you through what you should actually get so first of all the dual katanas will require you a lot of key or at least enough key so you need heart especially because this will increase a lot of your power with the actual uh, dual katanas and the dual swords so as you can see key basically affects the dual katanas as you can see it will give you plus two point each time and uh, maybe three for some others it will give you a little bit of life and key so in this way you will have a lot of key and a lot of attack power thanks to the actual uh, dual katanas yeah so go with this one this one is extremely extremely important but this shouldn't be the most you need to get heart and the strength for the armor are just both the 20% of what you should actually increase so increase 20% of all your actual points go for heart and it will give you a lot more power strength same will give you a little bit of power and will grant you the chance to get the actual best armors too in order to move around with them and what should you what you should actually uh, improve the most in your skill tree is skills this as you can see gives you like a lot a lot a lot of power to your katanas you should increase at least this for the 60 or 50 percent of all your points you are actually receiving this gives you life it gives you basically the chance to improve your shots with uh, the ranked attacks it gives you a lot of key pulls it always gives you samurai points and ninjutsu too so you totally need skill and thanks to these you will actually be able to also uh, get some ninjutsu power because as you can see, the dual katana can be well combined th with the jutsu. And in this case, this is what I totally recommend you to do. To get this one, and for the points, get a little bit of uh, ninjutsu capacity. Then combining those two, it will be amazing. So, spend 20% of your point in body, 20% of your points in stamina, 50% or 60% in skills in case you don't want any ninjutsu. And then spend the rest of them. In case you want magic, just go for magic. Otherwise, you could spend 10% of your points in ninjutsu, having them all the other things you actually need, because the ninjutsu will give you a lot of uh, a lot more movement speed. It will give you a lot of really useful ninjutsu, especially for your dual katanas. It will give you the chance to throw kunais, and a lot, a lot, a lot more. But especially the dashes you need with the dual swords. With this one, you can do a lot faster, you can do them a lot faster, and uh, they will require a lot less key. So, ninjutsu goes extremely well for your dual katanas. 
so you should build 10 percent of dexterity otherwise if you don't want that go 10 percent or eight percent of your points in magic and you can then be a half um, dual source fighter and a half magician and two percent in here but this just depends on you and apart from that this is the best possible build you can you could give to your dual katana so try it out you'll see you'll be a lot fast and uh, you'll see that your key will won't go down much and you will be basically able to super dash extremely easy and uh, uh, requiring no possible key at all well as you know basically i didn't follow this build but in, if I would, this attack would actually remove a lot. Yeah, I am in total love with the dual katana. When I tested it on the other game, it was extremely successful using this build that I actually suggest you to get. And well, the one I actually built is uh, it goes well for the spears, but nothing actually forbids you to use it for the actual katanas. Anyway. If you are going for the katanas just upgrade the stats i suggested you to and let me know how how are the results you will get it but i bet they are amazing in the your game like this this bet is actually the best possible build i could have guessed so this bet was totally won well and this is everything you actually need to do in order to build the best katana dual katana build ever let me know how it goes for you. I will be waiting for your feedback in the comments below. Apart from that, I will just wish you a great day ahead and I'll see you for sure in the future for some more Neo tutorials. So is everything for today then. Catch you later. Cheers. Alright, so we did also the um, dual katanas thing. We did the axe and the dual katana wow so yeah okay by nico sleeping now all right you take care man i'll see you for sure later let's see how a dual katana looks like when it's combined with a magic power looks extremely cool oh my god he i was the faster archer but he actually was the most the most uh, the most i don't know wow check how much how much damage you actually are removing man man i i wish i could have gone for this one for proficiency wow guys i don't understand why just using this one you actually get why am i getting a lot of skill points just for this one no sense anyway i I am in total love with it. And with the spider that slows down people, pff, it's even better. Wow, wow, wow. The dual katana is just such an amazing thing. Check, check how much damage we actually did. Anyway, by going here, he should have his movement impaired. Let me get the, the the high distance. Wow, it removes actually a little bit. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, yes, but he almost killed us. I think that with the dual katanas, you should use the most the, the down. Are you using mid stance? That's the best for one to one. So one to one, yeah, I guess is a good compromise for speed and uh, for speed and strength of the attack. But this one is so cool, man. This would have been like amazing for when I fight it against a huge blob. But that's pretty much it, guys. We did most of the builds. I will carry on testing out how Neo goes, and especially now. What I'm about to do is uh, just purchasing some more ninjutsu because I'm going really well with it. I just want to build spear and ninjutsu. Even though I think that most of the people are actually uh, improving ninjutsu and the actual. Uh, so they probably do. No, 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 ninjutsu. They probably are doing spear and uh, magic. I think this works a little bit more. 
And uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But anyway, we got a cover. We got it cover. What is the level up thing? Level up. I'm going for ninjutsu again. Yes, again. And yeah. I'm gonna show you what I want to purchase. Learn skills. Ninjutsu, oh my gosh. After throwing a shuriken, Prince to throw another. We just have eight points. This is crap. It. This is crap. It. So, allow the prayer for those of hand broth, apply to weapons. I actually am looking for the thing that allows you to dash faster. Uh, because I already got the actual. How are they called? I already have the. What level are you? I am level. Um, I am not level 55, let me check. I am level 58. It's not bad. Which level are you, uh, Kuka? And let me know if you actually need any guide on Neo. After playing it for so long, I can tell you basically everything, I think. So let me know, man, where you are stuck at, which number you are to, and uh, yeah, anything possible question you may have. So what I was trying to do was to 75, man, not bad. Which build did you go for? Katana, Axe, uh, something else? I'm actually go. I, I have gone for spear, and I'm in total love with it. So I need to level up dexterity, and we did so. So the other thing that I wanted to do was learning an injutsu, because I'm doing. I've seen a video where basically, if you get the right ninjutsu, as you are unbeatable, and my power with the spear plus the ninjutsu thing oh my gosh spear x and magic so overpower yeah man i'm going for spear and x too but um, i never used the axe which weapon do you use the most so because i'm going for spear and ninjutsu i just found like a, i'll show you in a bit as soon as i find the thing i want to buy the absorbs increase the resistance to paralysis allows to rate to medusa powers i don't care about so let me just find the dash thing I wanted to get. Scatter them on the ground to endure the feet of Persona slowing them down. Yeah, this is the Makibishi is exactly the thing I wanted. Uh, they explode and scatter mass Makibishi. Oh, this looks cool. Makibishi bow is totally needed. Uh, explode crown fire traps. Yeah, this is not the, the one I want. This looks cool. And they actually throw a lot of Makibishis. Wow. So the Makibishi is extremely useful. I got a purple sweet axe. Wow, man. But actually the purple. Which which element is the purple one, man? Is it the, yo the Yaokai element? I use the Sloth Talisman on bosses. Man, the Sloth is so P, man. The sloth, the one that basically... Um, wait, isn't the sloth the one that doesn't allow you to recover key? Because I can't remember if it is that one or the one that basically slows you down. Because the Makibishi is the same thing as the slowdown thing. I'll show you in a bit. Iga style Kyakukama, when thrown, they explode and cause damage. There are so many things you can basically use here. Horukudama... Yeah, the Kaikodama and the Lorukodama, man, they are extremely cool. Let me just see which one is this. This one is the bomb, basically. Which is cool, but it's not the thing I'm looking for. The fire shurikens, on the other hand, wow. So this is the bomb. You basically need it if you want to get the, um, the exploding shurikens. And I love the exploding. No, it's lost bosses or adds. Oh, I see. So it's the same thing as the Makibishi, basically. I'll show you the Makibishi in a bit. They are extremely useful. They don't always work for bosses, anyway. It works for any possible enemy, I think. And, well, I didn't know of them before today. And today, as soon as I tried them, man, I beat it a boss at the first go, which, which was something impossible for me before. Projected scroll, when used they shot from ranked weapon, even if you have no ammunition. 
that's cool, that's cool, but it's still not the thing I was looking for, increase the number of arrows that can be carried. Yeah, I guess I need to go for that one and increase the bow damage by 6% and the match lock. So don't ask me what is a match lock because I got no idea. But yeah, cannon rounds, cannon damage, parkour, reduces key consumed by a dash, yeah. Ah, shit, I, I basically need to use them. This goes perfect if you are using dual katanas, man. Running speed, yeah, well, I needed to learn those sooner or later, so I better learn them now. Allows you to ready one smoke ball, quick change scroll, to survive temporarily. Ah, this is also super amazing. And this is extremely, extremely useful, so I need to learn those as well. Cut walking scroll, when you use you can move in total silence. Extremely useful again. Yo, blue blazer! And kookaburra, yeah, I'll show you the makibishi in a second. And uh, yeah, the dashes. Well, those was extremely useful as well for those, um, for those elixir increasement too. I think your attack power will increase. Extremely useful for the katana. Again, one of my missions has zero difficulty. Wow, well, man, it means you are too strong. And armed for a human counterattack. Oh, really? When guarding against an armed human. Wait, so you can only use. Okay, this only works if you are basically uh, using the fists. So these ones I can skip them totally. Ninjutsu capacity by four. I totally. Ninjutsu capacity. Everyone. Guys, I need this. Damn it. How come I don't have any more skill points? I should have got this one. I'll save it for later on. Let me show you the Makibishi basically. It's the same thing as the broth, as the sloth uh, magic. It's above 12 in my country, it's Sunday, so you can tell me the top four subs. Oh, I still need to make up my mind, man. Anyway, this is the Makibishi thing. Have a look. So you throw them down, and the moment they, they, they step on them, they go slow down. So again, you just do a dash and you just carry on beating the crap out. Have a look. You just bring them to whatever you want them to to walk on. And it works basically as a trap. And then you go down. So you use them again and you bring them here. So you use the dash and you go back on. Now let me use... Yeah, in this case I will use this one. And as you can see, they are extremely powerful, man. Extremely. Extremely. And, uh, well, the ninjutsu I think is one of the best thing I could have ever gone for. Wow, it's between two hours already. Man, that was fast. Yeah, it was, man. Don't tell me, don't tell me. Wow, man, the dual katanas, they are so cool, man. Anyway, another one, yeah, so they go, they, their speed slow, and the fact is that if you push them back, you can basically combine this Makibishi with so much technique. The only thing that doesn't get to work for me is those poison shurikens. I think my target didn't get poisoned, they just got slowed down. As you can see, wow, 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 man, that was extremely strong. Well, and the elixir thing is so cool anyway. Okay, lem let me summon this one, level 56. I'll show you how powerful a spear build basically is. With the spear build, it doesn't matter if this guy is actually a lot of level above me. He doesn't stand a chance. Even if he's using this stupid magic of his. Oh, basically he's using this stupid technique. Oh wow, why does he carry it on using so all these different... Oh man, alright. I failed in showing you basically how strong the spear build is, but let me get a sec. Okay. Yeah, basically with the spear build all you need to do is wait for them to to step off their guard like this and then you pierce them from far. So this is how you can beat most of the bosses extremely easily man. 
otherwise then what I do in order to, to, to tire them is just doing these combos and as you can see you can basically you can basically tire them up pretty good but the first hit always needs to, to get it yeah otherwise it's simply like this so as you can see I have a lot of key and stamina too Wow, just this combo is so OP, man. And this is basically how my my thing works. Spirit him. Well, yeah, yeah, I could have used the spirit, but I'm basically saving it in case I find anything else later on. Well, with this combo, man, as you can see, man, this guy already lost. Man, two attacks like this and you basically get all of those people down, like super gone, super easy and uh, well, it's extremely cool. In this way you can do literally everything. So this is using a dual katana for example. Let me show you a little bit how it works. I don't get why, is it, why does he keep incenting this weapon. He doesn't understand that the powers cannot get mixed. Yeah. As you can see, like, wait, 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 I'm getting in a bad corner over here. Whoa, I was running out of key. This is how it got me. Okay, I parried. So, let him come. What the hell? Wait, I think he poisoned me. Yeah. Anyway, just give him a... What the hell? He's extremely fat. The dual katanas, they are extremely, extremely cool against against the spear, because the spear actually requires a lot of time to attack. But with this attack anyway, they most of the times they don't stand a chance. Yeah, as you can see. Yeah, that's pretty much it for them. Oh, he actually dodged. So luckily enough, man, I have a lot of stamina that allows me to do all of those things. But yeah, this super combo, which which actually has a lot of attacks, usually grants me to win. Like in this case, man. This is what I basically use. He's using earth damage. Oh, earth damage, so it doesn't poison. What the hell? Yeah, the spear, as you can see, is a little bit slow. But I like it, and especially at this stance when he does the jump and then he takes them. Oh my gosh, man, I am in love for this thing. Anyway, I think I will just destroy the last spirit, and then I guess I leveled up now for today. Oh my gosh, how cool was this attack? Wow. So, yeah, with the spear you can be almost as fast as with a katana. Well, wait a minute, what is he doing? Okay, let me change stance. Wait, 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 he slowed me down, I think. Oh, wow. Oh, man, this, this attack is ex... What? Oh, my gosh, guys, this guy can get me, actually. He did, almost. Let, let me... Wow, I guess for him it's extremely easy to to actually counter me. Yeah, but with this special attack, man, is is actually difficult to parry it. Maximum familiarity reached with the Seki Force touch. Oh my gosh! Wait, 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 wait! Oh, he got me! I can't believe it. Anyway, usually those things work pretty well, man. Usually, at least. This time I didn't have no... Um, no elixir, so it basically got me. Thanks to this trick of his. Anyway, also with the ninjutsu, you have this thing that you can attack from far, which is so cool. Yeah. Well, usually with this spear, I got no issue at all. Let me see if I can aim faster than him. 
yeah, I was able to. Anyway, yeah, uh, pretty cool. They don't stand a chance against this peer build. They don't stand a chance. And it just takes a little bit to work, but once you do it, oh my god. Anyway guys, I guess that for today I'll need to call this a day, I'll kill the last Revenant and then I'll save. He's a level 38, I wonder if it is the same as before. He is not, he's using a stupid spear. Wow. This one actually... What the hell, what a fucker. Yeah, he's now is movement impaired basically. Wow, and basically stands no other chance. Okay, let me get you a, a little shuriken. Oh, so I got him poisoned, finally. Thanks to this shuriken, he shouldn't be, unless he has an antidote, he shouldn't be able to recover again. Wow, no, he will be basically be recovering with time. Okay, let me do the same. So he can either die of poison or arrows, the choice is his. Anyway guys, it was amazing to do a streaming with all of you today, but for now I guess this will be it. So yeah, I'm uploading very soon these tutorials we did today together and then later on I'm going to call also Horizon Zero Dawn. So thanks a lot for staying with me until here and for today we basically cover everything. So thanks Boshan, thanks Blue Blazer and Kuka Bara for staying with me so far. It was extremely, extremely amazing. So thanks a lot for that. You are the best guys. Anyway. I will be seeing you soon for some more guides. So you guys take care and catch you later. Cheers.